Have you ever tried sea grapes? This edible algae is so delicious. It's also known as vegetarian caviar. Once a specialty of Okinawa, the algae are now also grown in Penghong County. But with COVID shutting down export lines, the market has gotten tough for sea grape farmers, leading them to branch out. Let's head to Penghu to find out more. Farmer Chen Dingwei pulls his crops out of a cultivation tank. These sparkling crystalline fruit are sea grapes. The green clusters look grape-like, but growing them is painstaking work. One thing it does is that when it reaches its peak, it starts to detach. You have to make it reattach. It's at its best from 45 to 60 days. Over 60 days, it starts to disappear. Sea grapes are a kind of green algae. Its distinctive texture earned it the name vegetarian caviar. Okinawa was once the only spot where you could eat farm-grown sea grapes. But in the Penghu Islands, climate and sea conditions are similar to Okinawa, and in recent years, it's become a domestic sea grape center. But COVID has meant farmers have no way to export the crop, which is why this biotech expert stepped in to help. Originally, these fresh sea grapes gave people an opportunity for a kind of vegetarian caviar. With a pandemic last year and this year, the sales avenues got blocked. So we quickly moved to bringing this ingredient into our company to do research. Just Chen's farm alone can produce 10,000 kilograms of sea grapes a year. These biotech experts are hoping to turn the delicious algae into an organic health food line sometime soon.